you join us for an evening routine with a baby. <gasps> oh, lots of dribbles. We're in the dribbling stage. So if you see lots of dribbles or he's literally soaking wet, that is why. <laughs> So yes, we are doing an evening routine. I did a morning routine. I think I did, I did a morning routine before and everybody really liked it. So we're doing an evening routine. And now our evening actually has some substance because we are putting him down before we go to bed. And then we're waking him up and doing a dream feed. Um, so I will put timestamps in the video so you know what time everything's happening, kind of how we're doing it. I don't, I don't know if I'm doing it right, but we're going with the flow. Okay, we're just doing our best, aren't we? So it is currently half past six in the evening and at the moment we are just trying to entertain him. <coughs> oh, Teddy, quiet. And we are just trying to entertain him for the last hour and a half before he's going upstairs. Okay? So some, by this point of the day, like, it's been a long day. Morning, as soon as he wakes up, that's his best time. He's ready to lay down on his own, he's having fun. This time of day, if you want to try and put him down on the floor, Good luck to you. We've got to play with you. <gasps> so yeah, I've got to think of things to do with a baby that can't sit up or do anything on his own for the last hour and a half. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh, you don't want mummy to sit down. You don't want mummy to sit down. Okay. We are at the point in the evening where you can't sit down. Okay, mummy stand up. If you even think about sitting down. Okay. You're in big trouble. Stand up, mummy stand up. Come on then. Sitting up, mummy standing up. Bear and shaka, bear and shaka, doll may do, doll may do. Friends are like, oh, are you, Annabelle, do you want to come out for um, dinner tonight? I'm like, no, I'm busy. <laughs> this is what I'm doing. Do, 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 do. Oakley hold. <gasps> Don't hit me in the face. <laughs> bum, bum. Can you hit it? Whoa, you are very advanced. Bum, bum. So it is now quarter past seven and I'm going to feed the baby now. Come on, Oakley. You want your milkies? Milky, milkies. I have just come upstairs to Oakley's room. If you have not seen his room, I'll quickly show you. Um, but you know, it's so funny. I can see outside our petrol is being filled up. So if you don't live in Dubai, in Dubai, you can go on an app click for petrol, you just leave your petrol cap open and then they just come and fill your petrol up. And it's the same price as the petrol station. So we don't ever go to the petrol station. They literally just like bring it to our house and do it. It is the best. So yes, here is Oakley's nursery. He's got like this, a little book section, a lovely chair, it's a little bit messy, but that is life. It's actually a lot messier this, but we actually just tidied it. Um, so this is like the crib. He's never actually slept in this yet. This is when he's a bit bigger. Bedtime. It's only his bed, bedtime. It's five to eight and I'm just going to now run his bath. He has a little bath. He loves his bath, which is so cute. It's only his bedtime. Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? Let your dada. Is that your mama? No, don't pretend. <laughs> Basically, I kept saying to Joe, like, I do it all the time to like reinforce like that's his dad and I'm like, is that your dada? Every time he comes, I'm like, dada! And Joey never does it to me. So I'm like, he's gonna know your dada, but he's not gonna know I'm mama. And then now, he's, I, we had this conversation about 20 minutes ago. So now he's pretending that he does it all the time. <laughs> is that your mama? Is it? Yeah. And he goes in this little baby bath, inside the bath. We are using the Aveeno baby. And this thermometer is by Luma and it's so good. You just drop it in the bath and then it tells you the perfect temperature. It's so good that Annabelle yeah. even used it for her own I bath. I used it in my own bath. And we are aiming for 37, 37.5, maximum 38. For me, 31. Don't, that's freezing, Joey. No, it's not. Joey, 31's freezing. It's okay, like, it's 34 like a, then. 31's like a swimming pool. Really? Yeah. Okay, 34. No, Joey, if a baby's got 37, you would have at least that. I don't I like it I would have 39. I don't like it hot. I'll get over it. I don't like it hot. Joey, you don't like it that cold. That's freezing. So, what's going on with your collar? <laughs> I don't know. I, I really don't care. <laughs> I, literally, every two seconds, my buttons all pop okay. open because he pulls it. He's laughing. Love your bathy, don't you? By the way, I don't give him a bath every night. I do it like... Every other night? Every other night. Sometimes. Three, maybe. four times yeah. a week. Because apparently it's not good for their skin. But tonight... It's bath night. Tonight is the night. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> What's your daddy doing to you? <laughs> Is that your lovely paw? <gasps> splish, splash, <laughs> splish, <laughs> splash. Yay! Yay. <gasps> splish, splash. <gasps> splish, splash. <gasps> Are you having a lovely bath? Well done, sweetie. Lots of kicking. Shall mummy get your... Do you want to put some water over you? I've got this... We do this thing. I... Lo I I don't know where I saw I feel like social media to get them prepared for swimming and doing the where they go under water. <laughs> to get them prepared for when they go under, under to get them prepared for when they go under water, you should pour some water over their head in the bath and you should say like a code word. So our code word is one, two, three, and then I pour the water. So then he starts to expect it. So then they know to like hold their breath. Well, you got some water in your belly. One, two, three, whoosh! Ooh, well done! One, two, three, whoosh! Ooh, well done! <laughs> right, this is the classic baby outfit, it isn't is, it? Like, yeah. You put the little towel with the hood. I think it's from White Company, right? I think it is, yeah. Oh, no, it's not! Mamas and Papas! We got oh. it in Mamas and Papas! Oh, look, the um. The robe is from White Company. The white robe is from White Company. This is from Mamas and Papas. Let's put your greenies on. This whole vlog is just us singing. Yeah, but this is what I do. Everything's a song. Yeah, but everything is a song. I try and keep him entertained. I'm just like singing everything 24-7. After this bath, I always make sure to put some cream on him. And I went to, I well, still am going, to a baby massage class. Oh, yeah. So I use some of the little like techniques that they told me to do in the baby massage class oh. when I put his cream on. And I also sing baby massage but that is not in the class <laughs> you push up you push up and then you do a little pressure point what should we have for your book apparently it's good to do a book even at this age so we're doing a book every we're night doing a book. definitely not harry potter <laughs> no. but something short Seriously, and sweet harry potter. did you want this one i love you forever and a day that's, that's a yes, a yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's clothes on the chair but we're just going to sit on top of them yes of course we are bash i could imagine a day just for you the sun would be shining, the sky would be blue. I would tell you a story, I would sing you a song. Let's get you in your sleepy bag. <gasps> Lovely. Uh, oh, uh, time for bed. Ooh. It was a sad day when we had to move him out of the swaddle. Oh my God. We put him in the sweep, sleep, we put him in the sleeping bag and I thought everything was gonna Go screw up. Right. Yeah. But actually it was okay. The transition you was okay. Kind of a smart boy. Now you sleep in your sleepy so now the rationale is we get him in a little bounce. Shh. We do a little shushing. But then once his eyes get a little bit heavy, we put him down. But we don't, he doesn't go fully to sleep. So before you would like get him to sleep and then try and like. But now we get him a little bit sleepy. Shh. We get him a little bit sleepy and we put him down and he's got to settle himself. Shh. And if he's still crying after like two minutes, then I come up and do a little shh, and then I go back down, and then usually he just goes to sleep, doesn't he? Mm -hmm. And then I put him in here, so we put him in the next to be crib with a little camera. Shh. Okay, so he actually went down first time. I didn't even have to go in and like pat him again and settle him. Not at the moment anyway. Let's see how it goes. Um, I will keep checking on the monitor. But it is now mummy and daddy time. Um, I think we're going to watch, God, what is it called? Love is Blind. I think we're going to watch Love is Blind. We have recently started actually cooking um, once he's gone to bed, just so that we don't have to like kind of deal with him basically when we're cooking and eating. So even though it's a bit late, it's just a lot easier. So I am just about to put the food on. Um, we had a barbecue the other day, so we have got some burgers that haven't been used. So I'm gonna do like burgers with like a salad and some chips, bosh. So only after he was about like three months or something, did we actually even start putting Oakley upstairs, kind of before we went upstairs, we would just kind of keep him like down here. Even if he had like a little sleep, he would sleep down here. Um, but then now we put him up to bed obviously. And then we come down and we actually have an evening and it's like, oh my goodness, we're having a little evening to ourselves. Um, so yeah, that was a bit mental at first. We were like, what are we gonna do? Um, obviously it is a bit long to be, you're like, you've got like two hours of your own time now. And then now I've got to cook dinner, which is kind of annoying. But it's more annoying to have to like deal with the baby while you're cooking. 
I feel like I'm gonna have, I'm cutting this really slowly because I'm talking. Kendall Jenner, she was like cutting the cucumber, <laughs> really rubbish. <laughs> and everyone canceled her. <laughs> that's gonna be me. Does anyone else's dog just like salad? Like I don't really think that's normal. Teddy sit. That he literally just like loves salad, like lettuce, cucumber, pepper. He literally loves all of it. Good boy. We are sitting down for dinner. I have got a burger in like this ridiculous hot dog bun because that is all we had left over from our barbecue. So that is what we are using. So never mind. Some salad, we've got some chips and we've got a burger in a hot dog bun. So yeah, don't judge that. It was funny, the first time that we ever put Oakley up to bed and then came down on our own and had dinner on our own, we were just sitting here, we were like, Oh my god, <laughs> this is so weird. What do we do? Yeah, we're by ourselves. Do we need to finish, finish Love is Blind? We do. Um, so we need it's to finish Love is that. Blind, yeah I know. Um, and then we will make his dream feed and go up to bed. Shit, Even when so he's not with us, he is still with us. It's coming up to half past ten and we are making the dream feed. So I am now doing, what do you call it, combination feeding. So half breastfeeding, half bottle feeding and we're using Kendra milk. <laughs> and we use kendermill. Kendermill. To sometimes I lose Why count. do you use kendermill? I heard it's a good one mm. on the mums Dubai mums Facebook group. Oh, really? They say kendermill. Do they? They say kendermill, or some of them some say hip organic. Um, but kendermill, kendermill says it's made in the Lake District and all this stuff. And, and we're British, organic. aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> we're not from up north. Um, no. Do you know what I think? I've lost count. People say yeah. that they might get used to the Kendall Mill and then too. if you try something else, they might not like it. Yeah, I know. And it was sold out the other day, wasn't it? And I was freaking out. Do you reckon it's like changing from like Coke to Pepsi? Oh my God. And you might be like, no, thank you. What a conversation this is. It's great. Coke to Pepsi. It's going to taste great. Do you know what? Sometimes I'll actually give a little extra just in case. A little extra? Yeah. What, on the dreamy? Yeah. Oh gosh, I'm On the excited. dreamy feed. And this is like literally the best thing ever. So it's the Tommy Tippy, what is it called? Perfect prep machine. You stick this under here, it's like a little coffee machine. You turn it on. Although you it select, doesn't serve coffee. No, you select how many ounces and then you just- How many ounces then? Uh, five. five ounces, add formula done, place on the stand, and then now it's adding a hot shot. So yeah, it adds that hot shot, and then you put the lid on, shake it, because that's supposed to kill the bacteria in the formula or whatever. Um, and then it makes the perfect temperature bottle and fills it up to like the amount. So good. Shake, shake, shake. A little barista. I'm a little barista every evening making this little bottle. It's actually quite, um, it's actually quite pleasant. Oh, it doesn't smell very nice. It's actually quite, um, pleasant. Joe, can you shut the frick up? I'm filming. Oh my God. Sorry, I'm just tidying up. Oh, get over it, mate. No one cares. Um, what was I just saying? Yeah, I feel like it's actually quite a pleasant experience when you make it on this little machine. Don't you think, Joe? It is fun, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But that's maybe because we don't drink coffee. Yeah. Um, you are joking. You're not making more traction and banging. <laughs> Shut up! Sorry. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's quite fun actually to make the bottle and then take it up and it makes it the te perfect temperature. Um, Joe, I promise you, make one more sound. Um, and then now we're gonna go up, so he's asleep still. And he's been asleep for like two and a half hours. And now we go up, wake him up, and he's so like, mm, he's so squidgy when we wake him up. And then we feed him his bottle and then put him straight back in. The aim is don't talk to him. Like, I mean, sometimes we, we, we both wanna like kiss him. Like we're like, and we're kissing him. But we're not trying to talk to him too much. And then straight back in bed. To the morning, if it's a good day to the morning and he would sleep through from now till like six or 6.30, at the moment, we're having a small regression, um, so we're waking up sometimes like three, four, five, and it's like, thank you very much. Let's do this up. Oh yeah, by the way, at the moment I'm using these ones, bibs bottles, and they're glass. We didn't eat that fruit that we were meant to. Oh sugar! We need to eat that tomorrow. Oh, it's time for your dream feed. Joey likes to get him out. Joey likes to give him a hug before I feed him. Dream feed. Good baby. The other baby's here. He likes to come up for the bedtime routine. Oh. Hey, you have time for your bottle. He's looking at the camera. Hey. Excuse me. You what are you looking at? Mummy and Daddy love you, don't they? Sleepy time for Oki. Okay. 
So he usually finishes all his milk, doesn't he, to be honest. So I give him like a nice good yeah. five ounce bottle for this little dream feed. And then I don't feed him now after this until the morning. So aim for seven sometimes. If he really wakes up early, it ends up being 6.30. Well done, I think, is that your bedtime routine? <laughs> so yeah, after this, I'm literally just gonna put him straight back in there. I don't rock him back to sleep or anything. I literally just put him down and turn the lights off and then he settles himself to sleep. Um, usually quite good usually that, quite isn't quickly, it? Yeah. Almost as sometimes quick as goes me. Like, oh, oh god, not you. Joey settles himself to sleep very quickly. <laughs> so annoying. And I want to punch him in the face when he's he sleeping. Yeah, very annoying. So yeah, well, I just put him down and then he stays asleep. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Stay asleep for mummy, yeah? Because you didn't last night. <laughs> <laughs> um, thank you so much for watching and see you again soon. Bye!